Hi, I'm Wolfi Kahaku, and you're watching Card Fight Kahaku. This video is brought to you by Chaos Cards. Check out chaoscards.co.uk for all your card fight, Yu Gi Oh!, Magic, and other needs. Nationwide distributor for card games, board games, and many other things. This is a deck profile for my Pale Moon Magia deck. It's very fun, very cohesive. And I just enjoy it very much. I actually took this to Nationals and I didn't do very well. Uh, I actually got a really, really bad matchup first game. Pale Moon vs Pale Moon. Mirror matches never work out in uh, tournaments, do they? Anyway, enough about my ramblings. Let's get into the deck profile. We start off with our forerunner, Happiness Collector. Very nice, cute card. The same card that Luna uses in the Card Fight Vanguard um, G anime. And she makes her appear appearances from G Gears Crisis, I believe. Yeah, from Gears onwards. So we start off with Happiness Collector at 1. Nice little foreigner, nice little ability. Quite useful. Then we have 4 copies of Nightmare Doll Mirabel Critical Trigger. Four copies of Silverthorn Assistant Dixie, Critical Trigger. Two copies of Kitten Juggler, Draw Trigger. Two copies of Silverthorn Marionette Natasha, Draw Trigger. Four copies of Tender Breeder. Uh, three copies of Tender Breeder, Heal Trigger. And one copy of Silverthorn Juggler Nadia, Heal Trigger. Which are some nice little cards. If you, if you notice, I go for mainly female cards, because they're the most you know, pretty, and I just like the look of the uh, female artwork. And then for Grade 1s, we have three Moonlight Melody Tamer Betty, three Cutie Paratrooper, two Signal Snake Tamer, one Masquerade Bunny, and then for our Perfect Gods, we have one Hoop Master, one Dark Side Mirror Master, and then two Water Juggler. They're, those Water Jugglers and the Signal Snake Tamer are the worst looking cards of the deck, to be honest. I only put them in there because I didn't have much space for anything else. It's bad choices, I know, but I could, they were the only thing I could use at the time and the only things I've got for the deck. Might check out Chaos Cards and see if I can pick up some things, eh? But that's grade one's done, and then, oh, I knocked the camera, that's okay. Then for grade twos we have three Hell's Gate Magician, three card dealer Jacqueline, one Flying Periton, one Dark Side Princess, one Dreaming Pegasus, one Silverthorn Marionette Lillian, one Nightmare Doll Master Brenda, and one Star Magician, Ellen. The synergy is a little bit off with this, as I don't have enough copies of uh, Dark Side Princess, I believe her name is. Dark Side Princess? Yep, Dark Side Princess, and I need more cards of Nightmare Doll, Master Brandy, to make it a bit more cohesive, but yeah, it works for me, and the vanilla 10Ks just get around things easily. And then we have... For our grade threes, we have a, a, a rather odd selection. We have three Nightmare Doll Chelsea. Oh, that's a Harry. Sorry. Three Nightmare Doll Chelsea. We have one Mirage Sword Judy. And then we have four Masked Magician Harry, which uh, I managed to get a copy of the... Uh, the hot print version, as you can see there, can you just get on the camera? Yeah, it says let the dream begin. Nice card, very nice card. Favourite card of the deck, actually. Next to the Happiness Collector. But yeah, uh, they're the grade threes and that's the main deck done. Moving on to... Dog, can you stop making noise, please? Okay, now moving on to the G deck, we have uh, my favourite card in the G deck, to be honest. Actually, I have two favourite cards in the G deck. I have uh, Dreamy Axel Millward, 
which I managed to pull three generation rares off it. You can see it there, yep, yeah, you can see it there. Three Dreamy Axle Millward, as you can see. We then have uh, two Arda Dragon Master Amanda. Uh, two Nightmare Doll of the Abyss Beatrix. One Curtain Call Announcer Mephisto. And for Utility, we have one Air Element Seabreeze and one Rain Element Madio. And that's the G units. Then for G Guardians, we have two Chainsaw Megatrick Furnival and two Metal Element Scryu. And that's the, uh, the Pale Moon deck. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you liked it, please support the channel by clicking a link uh, for an advert. Uh, check out chaoscards.co.uk for anything you may need. I've been Wolfie Kahaku, you've been watching Cardfight Kahaku, and yeah, have a nice day.